do away with astrography, to reduce unnecessary biopsies in breast cancer diagnosis, an international multicenter analysis conducted by Andre Forbet all. <clears throat> so what exactly is this study about? We know that breast ultrasound identifies additional cancers which are not detected on mammogram, but it has a false positive rate with, which increases financial and emotional burden. Elastic assessment on elastography was mentioned as an associated feature in the latest edition of the ACR Byrads Atlas, which is 2013. And it is based on tissue compression producing strain or displacement, which is smaller in suspicious versus non-suspicious masses. So we know elastography as having two varieties, the strain and the shear wave elastography, some images on the right and below, which are taken from our own work, which shows the areas which are soft or non-suspicious as white on strain elastography. And now with the use of quantitative elastography or shear wave elastography, the hard images as red. The velocity is taken in meters per second and converted to kilopascals. Coming to intelligent shear wave elastography, can it actually reduce the unnecessary biopsies without missing any cancer compared to B-mode ultrasound and traditional shear wave elastography? So there are two machine learning algorithms and uh, Kritika had a wonderful presentation which sort of enlightened us all about what this was all about. So there is one with logistic regression with elastic net penalty. And the second is logistic regression with neural red network, which he explained in detail. This particular study had a cohort of 857 women who underwent B-mode breast ultrasound, shear wave elastography, and histopathology at 12 study sites in seven centers, uh, seven countries. It was trained and tested on 11 sites with tenfold cross-validation validated on the remaining largest sites. The outcomes then were plotted. <clears throat> and this is what they showed. So if you can see, there's a comparison in the diagnostic performance of B-mode breast ultrasound, traditional shear wave, which we know of, and intelligent shear wave elastography. And the highest or the greatest accuracy is produced by the group which has the neural network. So there's certain important things that you have to look at. The AUROC, as Kritika had explained, or the area under the region of curve, uh, the most important area under the region of curve of interest. If you have values between 0 0.8 eight and 0 0.9. Such values are considered excellent by statistical data. Values greater than 0 0.9 are outstanding, which is seen in both intelligent shear wave elastography with net penalty and with neural network. We also look at both negative and positive predictive values. <clears throat> the negative predictive values with both intelligent shear wave elastography forms showed a value as high as 100%, which is phenomenal. The positive predictive value of 61.5% was seen with neural network, which is far greater than what we see with shear wave elastography and far more than what we see with B-mode ultrasound. <clears throat> In our experience with shear wave elastography at our center from 2014 on Siemens S2000 and its correlation, we found that shear wave elastography has very encouraging results as such, in distinguishing between BIRADS 3 and 4A lesions, which are not easy to differentiate on B-mode. And this particular thing shows that even the area which is green shows a value of 4.38, the area which is the hardest could be far above 4.5, which is considered as the cutoff value. <clears throat> Machine learning algorithms have the potential of being then the future of diagnosing breast cancers without biopsies very, very important. This will reduce both the economic and the emotional burden on the patient. The little figure I have below has shown the difference between deep 
learning, machine learning, and artificial intelligence, which Kritika explained as well. <clears throat> so according to the multi-center study conducted by Andre, a machine learning algorithm, which is intelligent shear wave elastography, reduced unnecessary breast biopsies by a whopping 50% without missing any cancer compared to breast ultrasound, which is a phenomenal amount. Thank you for the patient hearing. We would be coming out with our own atlas on breast elastography in a, within a month or so. Thank you so much.